Hello and welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we're going to do another uh, WRC10 video uh, while using the uh, Camus direct drive uh, 5 newton meter wheelbase. Now, in order to make this video, I had to make it so I could do the 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 throttle and the <laughs> the brakes on the uh, on the paddle shifters, which is which is fine. I mean, I, I don't have a, a, a set of pedals that I can directly hook to this um, particular wheelbase just yet, but I wanted to uh, I wanted to take a minute and just show you guys this um, this wheelbase. We're gonna do Estonia. I really like this. I really like this stage, but we'll do the we'll do the long one in reverse. Let's go to clear. Um, Hopefully this video turns out good. We're just going to do this one. I'm going to do this race. I'm going to kind of talk to you as we are going along. And uh, we're going to we're going to see what kind of a interesting time we can have with this. Now, I've been sitting here for a little while playing with this. They sent this out to me today. I wanted to thank Camus, you know, for sending this out so that we could show it off. I'm very happy with this. Like this here, like for some reason that that 15 Newton meter wheel blew me away when they first sent that one to me and now this one here is here blowing me away and i just spent like 1350 dollars well 1341 for a fanatec setup and uh man i i don't know what it is about about the camus the, the camus you know direct drive wheel and uh and 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 why this feels better to me but it it just does It it just it just instantly feels better to me. Now, actually driving like this is actually kind of fun. To be con com completely honest, it's almost like a hybrid controller type deal. <laughs> it it actually like seriously, man. If I was on trip right now, taking this with me somewhere, because that's basically, you know, that this 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 setup is actually really good for this. Um, I've got my uh, force feedback or or the overall power set at fifty percent. And and it still feels better than you know that that freaking that Fanatec one. That Fanatec man, it just it's too smoothed out, man. I really 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 like this raw, this raw feeling of of the uh, of the of the Camus. Such a better experience in my opinion. Oh no! I tell you wreck. But even when you wreck, man, you can just you can just feel that uh that power in this wheel man when you're sliding on the ground and stuff like it it feels so nice <clears throat> i like the way this one feels better when i'm sliding around in the dirt especially on wrc uh that camis that the, that fanatec feels pretty dang good on like dirt rally and you know games that actually take advantage of the fanatec stuff actually feel pretty good you know set of course of competency only but games like this where where the uh force feedback just kind of feels um, really super raw and 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 like in your face. I think the Camus does it better. Camus does it way better. Uh, I haven't been able to test this out on a set of course of competizione just yet, but I will as soon as I get an option to, or as soon as I get the opportunity, as soon as I can figure out a way to make it work with that. Um, either a similar way or once I buy the the adapter to use my pedals with with this setup. Um, that's, that's probably the way that one's going to go, but I will keep covering some of these rally games with this wheel to tell you the truth. I'm probably going to leave this thing hooked up just like it is and continue to make some content with it. And then once I get, uh, that thing, maybe I'll switch it out over there and start using this to, to make some content for, but that's the biggest reason I haven't been using the 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 15 newton meter one i might actually buy like a little stand for this because to tell you the truth i really do like how this thing feels i would really like it if they could uh get us some console support though on one of these things you know like an xbox version of this and and a playstation version this would be incredible for those this would be incredible for these those they they could sell so many of these freaking things it wouldn't it would be wouldn't even be funny especially at this price point under 300 bucks my goodness and i believe that there's going to be some stores that are going to start carrying these soon uh the boxing packaging and everything that this came in very very nice 
Uh, really nice unboxing experience for this. Um, everything you need is there. All your all your hardware for for getting this 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 thing set up. Everything's there, and that was that's really nice. All the screws fit. All the all the holes were drilled nicely. Um, I believe that this right here is an actual retail version of it. Um, I've seen a couple of other videos that that don't have as many inputs on the back of their unit as mine does. Mine has a couple extra units. They kind of look like USB, but they look more like a proprietary, like UIS or something um, for for a different type of interface so that you can plug in like a, and there's two of them. So that's got me thinking that one of them's pedals, one of them's like a shifter or something so that you can, so that you can have a shifter and some pedals set up for this. Uh, the sleek look to this, to this wheel setup, very, very sleek, looks really nice. The buttons feel good. The, the, uh. The shifters on here, they they feel they feel nice. Really really fun to use these. Uh, what else? The uh, the leather steering wheel, like it feels so nice and slides through your hands very very nicely. Very nice, put together very very well. I like the thickness, the the circumference of the uh, of the actual steering wheel itself, like the where where each one of your hands go. It's nice and it's nice and good. You can get a better grip on it. It, it just it just feels a little bit closer to like a to like a real car in terms of you know the girth of the of the actual wheel itself pretty pretty nice uh the force feedback in this wheel feels very very refined it feels very nice it's um i i, I kind of like how it feels with it being like there in the center mass with with all of that there and then just kind of having your wheel rim out like when i saw this thing the first time before they sent this to me and i saw it like in somebody else's video I was like, ooh, boy, I don't really know about that thing. I, I wonder how that's going to feel. It looks cool, but with that being a smaller rim, you know, because I'm I'm such a stickler, I need a bigger rim. It just kind of felt felt better on, on these type of games. But this right here actually feels close enough to that overall Camus experience from the, from the 15 Newton meter one that I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, maybe it's just in the – maybe it's just in the software because after – a lot of time playing with the Fanatec, I finally got it to the point where where I'm like, okay, I like this. I like this setup. I like the way this is filling now. Um, but then again, at the same time, I'm like, oh boy. Now I don't know why you guys ain't got sound from the from the actual game. I I had it hooked up so that it should be it should be doing that, but we're we're not getting that. But that's not a big deal. We'll just keep driving and talking about the actual wheel itself the uh the way this feels when you're on tarmac when you're on when you're on dirt and stuff like it, it feels it feels pretty good there's there's some like extra feeling that you get with like a fanatec wheel that i'm not convinced to this day feels better than what i've got right here in my patty cakes right now what i'm doing right now and how i'm playing with this this feels great i i like this probably more then I like that Fanatec for this game. For for all of these WRC games, I like the the Camus far better, like like significantly better, not just a little bit. Like I, I love the way this feels when I'm <clears throat> when I'm hitting these turns and I'm sliding through this dirt. I I like the way the Camus feels over the Fanatec every day, a, a, anytime. I love I love this feeling. Like you could see like the whole thing just shaking my table and everything, man. Wow. This this little beast has got some dang power. Some power. The power is raw. <laughs> it is good. Oh my gosh. Sorry I'm making a lot of videos about this thing today, but my goodness. I'm I'm just blown away by, by this by the way this feels and how good it is. And I mean, you can't say that like, oh, I'm just shilling because why would I shill, bro? I got a freaking Fanatec. Why would I shill for a company like this? They're not paying me any money. <clears throat> They're not paying me any money. They just sent me a will. Like, why would I shill for something if if it isn't if it isn't better than what I've got? Like, that's I I simply don't feel like thirteen hundred forty one dollars is better than what I've got in my hands right now. I honestly feel like that. Like, there's. You're not going to be able to convince me that that other thing is better than this. Like, it's just not going to happen. That Fanatec took me a minute to get up and going. This right here, pretty much out of the box. Hooked it up. 
plugged it in, started playing this game, and I was like, whoa, man, that feels incredible. That's exactly that's exactly the feeling that I wanted from from the other Camus. And and like it's it's almost like consistent across the board with Camus so far with both of these products that I've tried. They also have an eight Newton meter model that they're gonna be coming out. I'm I'm really kind of hoping that they send me that one too to check out because I am, man. I'm kind of a Camus fanboy. I, I like what these guys are doing. I, I like that they're bringing affordable sim racing to the masses with direct drive technology. And even this is cool. Like, this is cool. Like, I think the other guys that got it before me, that was like a prototype model where this here feels a lot more, this looks and feels a lot more refined than what they were showing off. So I'm just like, whoa, dude, this is an incredible experience and an incredible value proposition for, for somebody that wants to get into sim racing and not really spend a ton of money like this here it, in my opinion for direct drive wheel this is like the perfect starter base the perfect starter base you can get in here you can play around with this you'll you'll be about 300 bucks you don't need to buy an expensive sim cockpit for this you don't need to buy um really anything else as you can see i've got a hook to this this plastic desk that cost me like 40 bucks over at um over at uh, target or something this is incredible Actually, I think I got this one at Walmart, <laughs> but this is incredible. The value that you get out of this and the uh, the feeling that you're going to get from this type of this wheelbase is 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 second to none, man. Like in this price point, you are not going to find a better option than this right here, it, especially with this being direct drive and everything else being built and belt and pulley. This thing's incredible. It feels great. It works perfectly. And it, it it is great, but yeah, like the only one thing is it's PC only. It is PC only, and that that kind of does that kind of does hurt it. So I, I keep making these videos, you know, suggesting to Camus that they that they find a way to make these compatible with with the PlayStation and Xbox, at least with this base. At least with this base, that 15 newton meter man, you're not going to need that unless you're really getting into like some hardcore sim racing um that's that's when i would recommend something like that but as for this particular experience like you're not gonna need you're you're not gonna need that much power like you you're not to just sit here and have some fun like you're not gonna need that much power so if you like this content don't forget to like and subscribe 